so we're out here in rattlesnake country i'm gonna make sure that the uh, music in this video matches the uh the content here so this property she tells me has a lot of rattlesnakes and i'm definitely scared of snakes uh, so she said make sure uh to close the door behind me so that's another good um thing about doing blm today because um i don't have to have hoses running in this is carpet detail so i'm going to use and um so uh, she, the reason why she said that is because actually she's had rattlesnakes in her house baby ones and uh that scares the, the jeebies out of me so i'm definitely gonna keep the door closed for her safety and for my safety and i'm definitely gonna be looking down on the way in so all right stay tuned Alright, so I did a really thorough vacuum. I'm gonna go ahead and pre-spray it now and uh, and uh, do some agitation before we extract. So I went through a pre-sprayed and then I pre-scrubbed and I noticed there's some areas that um, didn't really break up as much as I wanted to when I pre-scrubbed. So I broke out the ProSign on this is spot and stain remover. It's a really good product right here. I forget about it sometimes. But as you can tell, You can see how it breaks everything up just like that. Um, it works on blood, coffee, a um, bunch of stuff. Hook it up. Definitely got to get another bottle of this. So I like to go around and hit, hit all these what I think are going to be tough spots. Um, put a little extra effort into it. So by the time I go around with the bonnet, or if I was to extract with the wand, everything will come up so much easier on the first pass.
Okay, so I went over it with the um, that pad there. As you notice, there's some brighter areas where I was spotting with the Procyon, which tells me that the pad just wasn't picking up as as well as it should. So I got this pad. I got from Procyon. Um, I got a couple of them. They pick up extremely well. So. I had that problem over here, went over it with that bonnet and everything blended it. So So uh yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and blend all this back in as you can tell right now. All right, guys. So, um, finished up with the job. I will go through a do a little walkthrough video. Um, but as you can see, this is after I went over it. With that bonnet. Now, this bonnet might be worn out. Um, yeah, we got some soil in there, but um, it's just why it tells you, you know, chemistry matters and tools matter not all tools are going to work out the same now this bonnet i got i got a bunch of them when i first time i bought pro scion um about a year year and a half ago on which i do use that product as a pre-spray also but um i couldn't help but notice that these things really clean so much better than these things um the only thing is is that you gotta change them over um, quicker, okay? You, you need to, um, they don't last as long as far as cleaning, so you need to go through probably. So if it took you one of these, but front and back, you you wanna use two of these. But it's worth it because the clean is just so much better, okay? I went back over on this side of this bonnet. This is, well, no, this side of the bonnet. This is the room where I did the white carpet. That's after I did it with that, guys. So when I seen those white spots there where I treated with the Procyon, it just told me, I know it isn't bleaching the carpet. It's not picking up, up enough soil, right? I went ahead and scrubbed real good and spotted those stains, but the overall pre-spray and agitation just just uh, needed better aggressive extraction. So I highly recommend these guys um, go to the Procyon website. I believe they have them. All right, so, so yeah, this stuff works awesome. Do recommend having this, and they do also have a pre-spray. Okay, um, I think I might have, I think I might have one in the up there, a jug of it. Um, so stuff works really, really, really good uh, for people. Just I mean, just a spot remover to have around the house for coffee, blood, and all that stuff. Now, if, now if the coffee sat there for a long, long, long time, then you're gonna have to do like a uh, twenty, uh, twenty volume or, or a coffee removal solution of your choice. Yeah, um, I did a video on this. If you haven't seen it, I put it uh, the link below or the uh, description below. That'd be a link. So yeah, I already did a video on this, but um, I didn't want to use it till I put out the video, but you know how things go. Love it, by the way. Beautiful.
Alright guys, so I did recommend the carpet protection for at least the uh, room with the white carpet. And I did recommend for next time she gets a cleaning. But she said, is it too late to do it now? And I'm all, nope. So we're going to go ahead and apply that. Carpet break out here. All right. All right, guys. It's a wrap. So uh, thanks for watching. If you like what you saw, please like, subscribe, comment. You know the routine. See you in the next video. Try not to run over us. Maybe I will run over. I don't know. Some people love snakes. I'm just... oh, they're scared of them. Especially when they rattle. Alright. See you in the next video.